Okay. Hey yeah, guys, Zero Eleven here. And today, the Hobby Box of 2010, 2011, in the game, Heroes and Prospects. Here's the Prospects. 18 packs per box, nine cards per pack. In any given box of this, we're expecting two autos and two mem. There's a 150 card base set, 50 in the update set, but there's 150 here. And well, the side of the box tells you everything you can get. There are some very interesting things like the CHL shields, and there's plenty of inserts in here. Obviously it's heroes and prospects, so it's basically like legends and prospects and junior pretty much. So there's gonna be some throwback stuff. There's gonna be a lot of junior stuff. The Heroes and Prospect autos, there's so many of them, there's 161. Potential's pretty good. I'm not gonna run through all of them, but so massive, jeez. And of course, there's some uh, like active players then sprinkled in as well. But 1011 Heroes and Prospect, there's no licensing for the NHL. You got PK on the Bulldogs. And if they are in an NHL uniform, like Pelle Lindbergh there, you won't see the Flyers uniform, so. Yeah, there's actually patch autos in here as well. So yeah, in the game, Heroes and Prospects. So yeah, let's open this up. And because I always forget this box cost, I forget how much it cost. I believe it's in the 40 range. It was either 35, 40, or 45. I'll throw it up. But yeah, there we go. Let's check out the packs. All right, here are the packs. Pretty cool looking. Here they are, and let's take them out. Okay, packs are out. I'm pretty sure we're gonna have some he shoots, he scores in here as like a filler card. But yeah, let's check this out. 10-11, here's the prospects. I last did 0708. But yeah, let's check these out. Ah, beautiful. First card, Freddie Hamilton. Nice, there's Dougie's brother. He made the NHL, but he didn't last too long. I'm not sure if he's still playing. I don't think he's still playing, but there's Freddie. That's cool, I'll take that. There's Martin Furk. 109 mile an hour clapper right there from Martin Furk. Um, on the Kings now. Rookie, Halifax. Oh, cool. Mark Visentine. Another ice dog. That's cool. Um, Visentine, former first rounder by the Coyotes. He is retired. There is Mark Visentine. There's Michael Bornval. Shane McLaughlin. The guy that never made it. There we go. We got Rick Nash. Rick Nash. Oh, <laughs> immediately got a hit. It's PK. But first, we got Matthias Tenby. And Christian Hansen, Dave Hansen's son. But here's the first hit. We got a game used black jersey of PK. Now clearly that has to be a Belleville Bulls jersey. Him and his brothers played for Belleville. Belleville's now the Hamilton Bulldogs, but that was pretty cool. PK game used piece from Belleville. It looks really dirty too, so it's game used. Let's check out the back. Is it numbered? Game used memorabilia, PK Belleville Bulls. That's cool, I like that. All right, there we go. We got the guy in the packs on the cover there. PK Belleville jersey. Did it say it's from Belleville? Hold on. Yep, Belleville Bulls jersey. I should have pointed that out, but there you go. Okay, Michael St. Croix. Edmonton Oil Kings, that might not be pronounced right. That guy never made it. Hey, there's Phil Grubauer. Um, does it say where they get drafted from? Yeah, Washington Capitals, uh, fourth round pick. He's on Colorado now. There's Ryan Murray, second overall in 2012 to the Blue Jackets. There's Michael Chaput. I think, didn't he play in Vancouver? There is Emerson Edom. Emerson Edom, he had a lot of hype around him when he was on Medicine Hat. Um, first rounder by the Ducks in 2010. He did not live up to it. There's Edom. There's Francois Bouchard, Calder Cup champions. There we go, Francois Bouchard. So there's an insert right there. And you're pro no 910. 2010 Calder Cup. There's a he shoots, he scores. There's Andre Loktyanov, Manchester, and Colton Sevier. I like this stuff. I know there's not a whole lot of interest in like the current Upper Deck AHL stuff. Like when I did 1819, nobody cared. So I don't even know if I'm gonna do 1920. I probably still will, but there's not a whole lot of interest. I think this is way more interesting. You get more hits and it's more varied. But yeah, we got Eric Goodbranson. Eric Goodbranson, he was high picking 10. Thomas Philpley on the Quebec Ramparts. Devontae smith Pelly on the Mississauga St. Michael's Majors. I actually saw him on the St. Michael's Majors there. They turned into the Steelheads, but there's Devontae smith Pelly. There's Ryan Bork. Tyler Aronson. There's another he shoots, he scores. There's Kyle Beach, first rounder in, what, 08 or 09? That was a swing and a miss from them. Yeah, 08, 11th overall. Big swing and a miss right there. They drafted Kane the year before, and they missed out on Beach. Hey, there's Hopi, Brain Hopi. There we go. He wasn't a full-time regular with the Caps yet there, but there he is. And Ryan McDonough. 
The former Montreal first rounder in 07. There's him on the Connecticut Whale. The Rangers AHL. But yeah, that was part of the Scott Gomez deal, right? There you go, Ryan McDonough. Okay, next pack up. Just got the one hit so far. The PK uh, Belleville jersey is pretty cool, but it shows him on Hamilton. Jared Tenority. Brendan Ranford. And there's Brendan Sod on Saginaw. There's Tyler Sagan on Plymouth. There's Tyler Toffoli on the Ottawa 67s. I saw him on Ottawa there. And his teammates for what? Peter Morazic and I forget. Cody Cece, I believe. Way back when, but he led the OHL in scoring. I forget what year. It might have been the season uh, after this, or this season, 10-11. I think it was 10-11, but there's Tyler Toffoli. Luca Ciampini. This guy never made it. There's Zach Boychuk. Uh, bust. And Nazem Kadri on the Toronto Marlies. So it's cool. I like this stuff. You got the mix between the juniors and the AHL, so... <laughs> okay, there's Brock Bukaboom. I believe that's Jeff's son. There's Brock Boogaboom. There's Jerome Gauthier Ledoux. Leduc. Tyler Buns. I'm messing that there. There's Pelly Lindbergh. So there's a throwback one right there. Pelly Lindbergh. Picture's kind of not great. Oh, we got an autograph. Olivier Archambault. On the Val d'Or Fleurs, or whatever they're called. Actually, a pretty cool auto on him. Uh, is that on card? That might be on card. I don't see any stickers. So that's actually pretty cool. The player ain't great, but there you go. There's an auto. It's a pretty cheap one, but hey, I'll take it. He shoots his scores. There's Cal Turris on a San Antonio Rampage. John Moore. And Gary Nevgeny Dadonov. Okay, final pack of the first stack. Okay, all right. There's Curtis Hamilton. Joey Hishin. David Musel. Alex Galchenyuk on the Sarnia Sting. Third overall in 2012. And he's been bouncing around. Now he's on Minnesota. Brendan Shinneman. I believe he played on Phoenix or Arizona at one point. But there's Shinneman. He shoots his scores. There's Thomas Hickey. Chad Johnson on Connecticut. And John Carlson on the Hershey Bears there. John Carlson. All right, continuing on here. We've got two hits. So far, the biggest, best hit so far is definitely the PK jersey. But... There is Alexander Petrovich. This guy can honestly frick off, but there's Petrovic. I just remember him injuring Patrick Kane so he can frick off. Matt Pumple, he was the first round in 2011. So there you go, Peter Royal Peets, Matt Pumple, Ottawa Sanders. There's David Taze. Don't think he's related to Jonathan. He might be. There's Ryan Ellis. Back to back Memorial Cup champion right there, Ryan Ellis. World Junior Gold Medalist, Ryan Ellis. So that's cool. Jakob Kulbeck. Oh, we got another auto. There's a guy that never made it. And the next auto. Brett Sohn. Auto. Peoria Riverman. Uh, not a great auto. But yeah, that's a largely mad one. Brett Sohn. Hmm. As he shoots, he scores. Linus Omark, Spinnerama in the shootout. And Eric Carlson on the Binghamton Senators. Now they're Belleville. So there we go. There's Eric Carlson. That's interesting. Continuing on here with Heroes and Prospects. Okay. Kent Simpson on Everett. Sergei Bobrovsky, Russia there. There's Daniel and Henrik. Looks like they were much younger then. Probably picture was taken in the late 90s, probably. There's Dylan McElrath, former high pick. And then we have one of these 100 years cards of Eddie Shore of Boston Club. Because they can't say the Bruins. But yeah, these 100 years of card collecting, there's 25 of them. This is number two. So that's an interesting looking card there. It's like a little mini card, but it's not. So there we go. Eddie Short. Shoots his scores. Jordan Schrader. Former Vancouver prospect there. Schrader, right? Yeah, Vancouver. Yeah. Uh, Sergei Shirokov, another Vancouver prospect. And these people behind him are really yelling. And Dana Tyrell. Lightning prospect. Okay, continuing on here. We're halfway through pretty much all right there's boone jenner on the austro generals louis leblanc there's nail yakupov first overall in 12 richard ponick there's belleville richard ponick there's stanislav galiev on saint john the sea dogs oh here's another jersey national pride lars eller denmark there you go there's lars eller 
Um, there's Nick Palmieri, not Kyle. There's Michael Backlund on the Stockton Heat. And Luke Adam. So we already got four hits. Definitely the best one's PK for sure. The rest are pretty garbage, not gonna lie. There's Adam Larson, fifth overall in 2011 to New Jersey. Obviously, yeah, there's that. There's Ryan Johansson on the Portland Winterhawks. Ryan Spooner. Philip Deneau. Jonathan Huberto on the Sea Dogs there. Third overall in 2011. There's Quentin Howden. He shoots his scores. Corey Elkins and Ryan Stoa, the Lake Erie Monsters. Okay, here we got four hits. Maybe we'll get another one. We'll see. Michael Curtis. Derek Pouliot. He was a high pick to the Pens in 2012. John McFarland. Nathan Beaulieu. Mark Pissick, who was playing some forward for the Panthers this season. Got that. There's Ben Ferrario again, yeah. Travis Morin and Kevin Shattenkirk on the Lake Erie Monsters, okay. All right, final pack of this stack. Wait, I think there's six per stack. Okay, well, this is the last pack of the middle stack. There's a young Victor Rask right there. Sean Couturier, Louis Deming, Thomas Yurko, Gleason Fournier, what's that? Brad Thiessen, and we got a Thomas Tatar. There's Tatar, Grand Rapids Griffins, and Jamie Arneal. Okay, final six packs. I'm hoping we get another hit. Okay, there's Nino Niederreiter, Christian Thomas. There's Maxime Claremont, Kevin. We're getting some players that never made it. Son to her. Okay. There's Bobby Lou, Roberto Luongo on Valdor. And we got the 75 seasons. Jim Anderson, 1936-2011. American Hockey League. So there's that. Okay, there's Jared Stahl. One of the, I think there's another Stahl that never made it anywhere, but there's the fourth worst Stahl, or the worst Stahl that ever broke the NHL. And there's Chet Pickard, Calvin's brother. Okay, we got some pack. Five more packs to go here. Okay. There's Calvin. There we go. Got the brothers. Calvin and Chet. There's Austin Watson. He's on the Preds now. There's Olivier Waugh. There's Toby Reader on Kitchener. Oh, there's an autograph card behind it. Is it a good name? Uh, Michael Lotta. Okay. I mean, not horrendous. There's him on the Gulf Storm. Otto. So Lotta. He was a part of the... Philip Forsberg trade as him and Erat for Philip Forsberg. I'm pretty sure he played a little bit for Washington. Yeah, that's still not a great one. There is Michael Lada. There's Anton Hudobin. There you go, most interesting man in hockey. There's Eric Tangrady and Joe Colbarn. All right, final four packs. We got five hits, three autos. It's pretty darn solid. I mean, a lot of them are pretty bad. There's Craig Cunningham. Um, really unfortunate what happened to him. I believe he lost his leg. It's really bad, but he's working for the Yokes now. So there's Craig Cunningham. There's Peter Holland on Guelph. There's Olivier Archambault. We got his auto. There's a Nuge, Ryan Nugent Hopkins. First overall in 11. Hey, there's Pavel Bure. Again, the picture is not so great, but there's Bure. There's Jordan Wheel. He's on the Habs now. Uh, there's Logan Couture and Chris Terry. Final three packs. Final three packs, okay. There's Taylor Beck, Guelph. Zach Phillips, Max Iafrady, I would assume. There's Ryan Murphy, Louis Mark Obrey. There's Lars Eller, Cody Hodgson, and Tyler Ennis, okay. Final two packs of Heroes and Prospects. Final two packs. We got five hits. So I'm pretty content with that. Scott Glennie. There's Gabe Lanscock, second overall in 11. Kirill Kabanov. Brad Ross. I think he was a Leafs prospect, wasn't he? Yeah, second round pick of the Leafs in 2010. There's Steve Eiserman, hockey hero. Shoots his scores. There's Blake Jeffrey on. There's Dustin Tokarski, world junior uh, gold medalist for Canada. And Jonathan Blum. Okay, we got the final pack of 1011 Heroes and Prospects. This stuff is interesting. I mean, hit potential is great. You're going to get a lot of hits, but the quality of the hits might be a little suspect. Joey Leach, 
Hey, there's Jack Campbell on the Windsor Spitfires. That's cool. There's Peter Straka. Was that the one that uh, played for Philly brief time and had like a Young Guns in 15, 16 Series 2? There's Brendan Gauntz. Greg McKaig on the Otters. Connor McDavid went on the Otters in 2012. Exceptional status. So, but there's McKaig. He was a Leafs pick as well. Turned into Zach Hyman. There's Robin Goose. There's that. There's Alex Stalock on the, I'm not saying that. I forget how to pronounce that. Sharks. And Evgeny Grachev. So yeah, guys, there's a hobby box of 10-11 in the game. Heroes and Prospects. No shortage of hits, but the quality of the hits aren't too great. Except for that, that's actually pretty decent. All three of the autos are pretty rough. I'm pretty sure Loud is the only one to play in the NHL. And you got that Eller jersey, but... All in all, I thought that was an interesting break. So yeah, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. And as always, thanks for watching. <coughs> and I'll see you guys later.